Not an Oreo cheesecake protein shake, I don't want it. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a, ha, what else? Just another one of these. I have recently, as you guys know, from vlogs, from videos, I've been decluttering, de-stashing my life, trying to get rid of a lot of clutter. Yes, this still looks like the way it is. Hopefully we will get the new dresser, which is right here over there and get this out. Not have this bed frame anymore. So stay tuned for that. One of these videos, it will happen. I just have a ton of empties from the month of August and September. So if you guys would like to, mostly September, I can't decide or figure out if I'm going through postpartum hair loss or not because my hair just breaks off because I'm blonde. So let's just get right into this. I have a ton of stuff and I'm also gonna talk to you guys about how I am really seriously on a bright gray now. First, we have the Grunata Pulling Oil Coconut and Mint. I finished this, yes, it's in a bag because this stuff gets so oily. It gets all out the outside of the bottle, the top. It's just disgusting. That's why I keep, hello. That's why it falls out of my hand. That's why I keep it in a bag. I love this stuff before I brush my teeth, especially again, now being postpartum, when I was pregnant, my gums bled all the time and that never happened before I was pregnant. So I felt like I finally got my dental health to a good place. And then obviously pregnancy, I feel like kind of messed that up. And even now I'm trying to get back to that place and we're still, we still have teeth issues. I still need root canals. I still need things. So moral of the story, brush your teeth okay just do it new packaging do we remember this these are the eight greens daily greens gummies and apple love these i'm on my second container i just feel like they really help my stomach and help me to regulate my body i don't know after pregnancy i'm really just trying to get back to myself and just get everything back to normal with me so i feel like these really do help i know a lot of people say a lot of things about greens these help me i like these scrub actually we have two of them in here we have the tree hut cocoa colada Colada. I don't know how you want to say that. Body scrub. I love tree hut scrubs. This is just one that I finished. I still have my Joyco Blonde Life Brightening Mask, which yes, I was one of those people. I cut the top off. There's still a little in there. I'm kind of mad. I actually ended up putting this in a different container with one of my other conditioners just so I could like condense stuff in the shower as well because I'm really sick of having things. Like I, I can't stress that enough to you guys. I am so sick and tired of just accumulating crap. I just have so much I'm over it more so than I ever was before. Maybe it's just because I'm a mother now and I just, I can't stand to look at it. It aggravates me so much. Next few months, there might be a series on my channel of decluttering things again, I don't know. My son's crying, but his dad is with him, so it's fine. Let him be a parent, let him be a parent. <laughs> Does anyone, any other moms do that? Just let him be a parent, let him be a parent. Dry shampoo, I just finished this just now so I could uh, have my hair down for this video. Plump for Joy dry shampoo in the orange mango fragrance. It's okay, I feel like this is one of the products that has messed with my scalp. I don't know what it was. I think I talked about it in a video or a vlog, but my scalp has just been so itchy, full of pimples, and and cuts and like I just can't stop like scratching my scalp or I had a period of that like maybe in July early August I feel like this might have been part of the reason why I'm not quite sure about that it was okay it got the job done let me purr <laughs> I recently combined a whole bunch of vitamins into one container so yes I love the lemmy vitamins I know they have a lawsuit right now I know whatever I don't care I like what I like and I use what I like so whatever these are the vaginal health gummies no they do not make your mm, smell like a pineapple that's what a lot of people were saying or that they were claiming but no it's just to promote vaginal health and I do really like that I take these especially after having a baby we're just trying to get everything right down there vitamin d sugar free usual finish the whole thing at night of these. <laughs> these, 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 these. Again, I combined this into another container. They are still good. These are the Lemmy Focus Concentration Gummies. I am so happy to be taking these again because I feel more focused and more just like concentrated on what things I need to get done and a lot of things that I want to get done around the house, especially since I'm hoping that my extended leave is approved. We'll be doing a lot of that in the next few months. It's gonna make me really sad. <laughs> these are the DLA body butters, body melt, and all these different scents. I got these last year and I stopped using them when I was pregnant after I have been trying to use them again. I just think that they've gone bad because I'm getting a whole bunch of like little baby pimples all over me myself. I have pimples all over the back of my arms, on my arms, like it's just in my legs. I think this might be part of the reason why. So I did order some new ones. This one is Crazy in Love, which is the pheromone body melt, which I'm a 
obsessed with the matching body melt to the perfume that's gone viral all over TikTok. Shout out to Kachi, I love her. I love that body butter. I've used that like every single day showering since i had brian love it it's just oh the smell like it's just my favorite i love that scent so much and then i have strawberry dream which kind of doesn't really smell great anymore but that one was a good one and then fruity kisses still smells good but oh wait maybe not oh god time to say goodbye unfortunately a little goes a long way with those as well deodorant we have the native candy shop gummy bears this is from a really old collection it smelled really good but now i can kind of understand where people were like why candy and why girl scout cookies as scents for body wash and deodorant kind of weird candy i can kind of understand with like body wash deodorant wise i'm like oh that smells good I don't know. Now if I smell this and it reminds me of postpartum and I just don't want to go back there because I did not have a very good postpartum experience if you guys have uh, remembered from my uh, <laughs> from my updates. We're gonna not smell that. Something else that's gone bad I'm very sad about the Tula Skincare So Polish Exfoliating Sugar Scrub. This leaked everywhere. I tried to use this the other day and it was just all chunky and disgusting. So this went bad unfortunately in my stash. Hence why we're trying to not have a stash anymore. Tree Hut Sparkling Sugar Foaming Gel Wash from Christmas last year she smelled really good she worked well don't think i'll repurchase just because i don't know i'm kind of over we'll see like i said i'm over having a stash so i the, a lot of the things that i do have i'm just trying to like get through it and then we'll just like decide like what we actually want to have in the shower one thing at a time not stocking up five of them samantha okay i also have another body scrub this is the strawberry one she also smelled really nice but also not one of my favorites i definitely wouldn't repurchase this because now smelling it after it kind of smells like medicine that's the best word to describe it as. Kind of has a little medicinal smell to it. If that's what you like, that's great. But for me, there's no way. St. Jane's Sea Drops. I know these are really expensive. I got it in like a, a box of stuff for Christmas. I don't know. I haven't used these in over a year, so we are done with it. But they were pretty decent vitamin C drops. They made my skin feel very hot. I don't know why. Yeah, it says 18 months on here. We've definitely exceeded that the mega babe thigh rescue anti-friction stick i loved this last summer oh my god this saved in between my thighs i went to use it this year and it is hard as a rock and there's no like little thing on here or date so we are done with her i got a little tiny one in my bathroom now we are no longer buying the giant one unless we absolutely need it other skincare stuff super peptide serum from good molecules i will never be without this this is to target the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles a girl wants to stay young forever so i I will never be without this. <laughs> the CeraVe Skin Renewing Night Cream. Love her, scraped her out to the bits. She's a really good night cream. I really like this. I really do like it a lot. A couple of random baby things. I don't know why I threw these in here. This is an Aveeno Baby Daily Moisture Lotion, which I was using on my son after baths and pretty much every single night I've been just putting lotion on him. I also bought the Aveeno Lavender one for baby that helps to calm them at nighttime. So we've been using that one now too. And I also have the regular one for his face, but now I'm kind of wondering if I should just stop doing it. I probably am gonna stop doing that because he gets a lot of baby acne. I don't know why. He had a lot of baby acne and then it all went away and now he just gets like random spots here and there but it just yeah we need to get some bacitracin or something. I don't know. And then of course I have Desitin. I finished a whole bottle. Controversial. Okay. Desitin. Oh my gosh my mom used Desitin on me. I'm using it on my son but I also have Aquaphor for babies as well because he does tend to get diaper rashes after his poops. I don't know why. <laughs> poops are just that crazy, I guess. He just has acidic little poops. I don't know. So we have that. This just went bad and uh, I haven't used it. The Bare Focus Finishing Powder from Wet n Wild. Love her. Haven't used her. She's just been sitting for like a year, so she's gone. The rest of this is stuff I don't like at all. This is the Elf Brow Laminating Gel. No, I didn't like it. So that's all there is to it. It was just not for me. This is an Elf Lip Line. I don't know what color it's in. It's too red for me. I recently found this lip balm. This was like my obsession for a few years. This watermelon, random watermelon mist lip balm. I don't know. I found it in one of my mini backpacks. I, I don't know. I have no idea. It is clearly expired. So she's gone. Finally, this is just an absolute, like, I just didn't like this. This is the Maybelline Firework Mascara. It just wasn't for me. I don't know. I feel like I've been having a lot of lash issues <laughs> for a long time now. No matter what mascara I use, my lashes just look like little, like, nubs and they never look used to look like that your girl's gonna try some DIY lash extensions it's over it I'm usually kind of bare faced like this all the time which is sunscreen bronzing drops and brow gel on the daily now so I feel like there's no point and everything's covered in yuck so that's fun 
Anyways, that is all of my empties for this month, August, September, whatever. Let me know if you guys want me to keep doing these videos. It just kind of helps me out and helps me to get rid of, wow, I can't talk. These videos just kind of help me to get rid of the stash that I have, which I'm very proud and happy to say that one of the drawers in my three drawer stash thing is now filled with leggings. So we are doing great. We are downsizing so well. I'm so excited. <laughs> I just wanted to keep going because I really would love to use those drawers for something else like clothes my things I'm still trying to get my makeup stuff out of Brian's room and anything that like I need like my nail stuff and all of that so I would love to just transfer that into my closet which was the plan the whole time I was pregnant but if you know you know it's just pregnancy you know things happen and my son is screaming and I need to go see what he's doing I need to let my husband be a parent but sometimes it's just like why is my baby crying <laughs> any moms relate any moms out there relate i love you guys so much hope you have an awesome day subscribe if you want to see more of me like this video if you enjoyed turn on bell post notification when the f i post a new video and i will see you guys soon for a new one i gotta go <laughs> bye